morning sports fans, ASMR Sports, right back at you. Alrighty, um, so today we're going to do some football stuff that I've been wanting to do for a while now, which is open up some 2020 football, and I actually have my computer here that, uh, I was gonna look up something on. So one of the things, uh, all right, so um, I'm recording this on Sunday, January 30th at night and um, the Super Bowl teams have been decided. It's gonna be the Bengals and Joe Burrow and Jamar Chase um, against uh, L.A. Rams and uh, Matthew Stafford and uh, Cooper Cup, the two stars of that offense. Um, so I've been wanting, because of Joe Burrow, to open up some 2020 football um, for a while. I don't have a lot. Um, okay. I don't have a lot, but I do have, um, I've got, I've got like 10 of these, um, Prism, um, uh, Mega Boxes from Target. I did not buy them from Target, I actually bought them for substantially more than Target. Uh, Chargers, I bought these, uh, actually I can tell you exactly, I bought these just about a year ago, um, in January of 2021, and I paid $167 a piece for them, and I want to look up right now what they sell for on, like, Blowout, if they have them. So, other than these, um, other than these 10 mega boxes. Let's see. They have them. Let's see. They have a lot of 20 of them, so they must have. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. So I found these on. Uh, so again, I paid $167 for each of these uh, when I bought them a year ago. Now they're selling on Blowout for $275. I'm sure if I looked them up on eBay, they'd be going for like a little over 200, maybe 200. That'd be my guess. Um, so other than these guys, so I guess that's been, you know, a semi-decent investment. But if Joe Burrow wins the Super Bowl, I think that all 2020 stuff is going to go up. So I also have uh, a number of cases of blasters, one of which I'm going to put in front of you here, right here. Let's change the camera here. Oops. Other way. Yeah. So this is a box of uh, Chronicles Football 2020 blasters, and I have four of these. Um, and these are still pretty dang cheap. Uh, so I'm going to open this up here before your very eyes. Come on, seriously. Sorry about that, um, that interruption in recording, but uh, 
if I I went and looked up what I paid for these Chronicles boxes and um, some of them I got for like about 29 bucks a box and then a bunch of them I got for 27 bucks a box in you know case quantities um, I can't remember if I said it in what I recorded before but um, uh, the, I think these go for like basically between like 30 and 40 dollars on eBay shipped that's with shipping um, so you know they're pretty low rent affair and um, I've, I've been wanting to open a blaster for a long time but didn't want to open up a case but now I've gotten over that uh, apprehension is a good good card and 
and uh, Chase Claypool. but really 
really not valuable at all. Maybe 50 cents or something like that. Sometimes I wish it was like a lot easier to put singles up on my site or, you know, like to do product entries on my site because I would just like, you know, take a photo of all these cards, list them, and then like, you know, they'd be a buck or 50 cents or whatever. And um, if you were buying something else, you know, and you wanted some, you know, some fun singles for cheap, you could get them and they wouldn't really cost you any extra in terms of shipping. You know, I mean, it's basically the philosophy behind ComC, check out my cards, where you pay one shipping price and you can kind of buy as many singles as you want, but I don't know, it's kind of, it's kind of, um, it's not that easy to post products on my e-commerce site, so, like, I tend to not want to do lots of little things, but I don't know, maybe I'll change that. Interested for your thoughts on that. All right, let's get into this prism. $167 right down, right down the trash. <laughs> but it's okay. I've opened a lot more expensive boxes than that, nothing, so, you know, $167 is a bit of a steal, feels like. Like a pink, I, I don't know if they're all pink, but I think they're probably all pink. 
is cool, guys. That is freaking cool. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, man, I don't have any, um, any of my thick card sleeves here, which I need. Wow, that's amazing. So a rookie, uh, I mean, it's a single patch, but, you know, this is like a prism-y kind of, I think it's a pink prism is what they would call this, right? Because it wasn't that the name on the, on the box here. Um, one mega box exclusive rookie pink prism memorabilia card per box. So that's what this is. That is freaking cool. That is freaking cool. Now, I don't, I don't know that this is worth really all that much. These cards tend to not be. I have a card like this of, uh, of Luca, where it's like one of the retail product exclusive, uh, you know, rookie patch cards. And uh, from 2018, Luka, Luka Doncic's uh, rookie year. And it's not really worth, like, much, although I haven't looked in a while. But, um, you know, maybe it was worth, like, 100 bucks. At its height, and I don't know that this stuff is going to be worth more than that. But a cool card. I mean, geez, you can't you can't ask for better than the one. You know. I mean, I guess we still have an autograph coming, right? But the one, you know, kind of like a one per box hit, uh, being the best guy that you could possibly pull right now. I mean, that's incredible luck. Incredible luck for which I am grateful. All right, here we go. This is a. Oh, I think yeah. So this is going to be the auto because um. That card is backwards, and I think that's maybe why it's created like a little bit of a, you know, like a thickness kind of feel to this pack. So I'm going to save that until later, and we're going to open the rest of these now. Man, that's cool. That is super cool. Well, we went Joe Burrow hunting, and we have uh, certainly succeeded. Michael Gallup, Zadarius Smith, Dexter Lawrence Pink, uh, and a Chase Claypool. Boy, if you're in a Chase Claypool, this is uh, looking like a pretty good break so far. Cards. 
I was talking about though, I, I think that got a 9. It's about as good as you can hope. This I would not grade because it's got a little surface kind of like dimple right there. But it's a cool card regardless. So we got that and we got some decent we got some decent rookies. Um Chase Claypool's a good one. And Gabriel Davis is the card of the moment right now. So there you have it. That was fun. That's our uh, 2020 football Joe Burrow Chase collection or edition, I should say. Uh, that was super fun. Yeah, I'm super psyched that I got like a really awesome Joe Burrow card out of two boxes. So happy camper. All right, guys. Appreciate you watching. Thanks so much. And, uh, yeah, I'm definitely rooting. I, bef even before this, I was rooting for the Bengals. I mean, they're, they're a feel-good story, right? They haven't won in it forever, if ever. <laughs> and, uh, Joe Burrow is an exciting, you know, young, uh, player in his second year. So, um, I, I typically will root for the team that has, you know, that kind of, uh, first or second year player on it because I think it's really good for the hobby for there to be a lot of excitement just like when um, oh gosh um, just like when the you know the Chiefs won uh, back in when was that 1819 um, you know hobby was nuts for uh, oh god what's his name Patrick uh, Pat uh, Pat Mahomes uh, Petro, Patrick Mahomes the second, uh, you know, his, him blowing up really kind of juiced the hobby up, I think, the football hobby, um, and like 2017, unopened went nuts, so like, I'm not really sitting on much 2020 unopened, but I've got enough of it that having one of the players, you know, in that, uh, year of product to do super well is gonna be good. I really was hoping for, uh, I was hoping for the Cardinals to do, uh, a lot better than they did in, uh, the end of the year, because, uh, Kyler Murray here is a rookie in 2019 stuff, and I have a mountain of 2019 product that, uh, you know, if that, like, doubled or tripled in value, I'd be sitting on a ton, and I'd definitely be ready to sell a lot of that, so, okay. There you have it, folks. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. We'll catch you all next time. You have a great one. Bye now.